Everyone wants 5G, faster internet, right? Downloads will improve and you'll get better cell service. But it means more of these cell phone towers. They will appear every 12 homes and neighborhoods. And some in the western suburbs aren't on board because they question the health risks. CBS 2's Jermont Terry is live in Hinsdale with the push to stop 5G. Jermont. Erica, this wooden stick right here is just the beginning of the 5G rollout. Now, if the companies get their way, instead of a stick, there will be a cell tower here. But this tower will not be 20 or 30 feet high. And that has some people in this neighborhood saying there's a bigger price to pay for 5G. So 5G. Meet three Hensdale moms. Paige. It's very alarming. Christine. We need everyone to take a stand. And for horror. This could be really bad. The trio's on a mission to stop 5G from coming into town. It is not just Hensdale. Western Springs, Naperville, and Schaumburg. A few months back, these wooden sticks popped up in yards throughout the western suburbs. That was placed here by Verizon as a proposed site for a 5G transmitter. Wireless companies insist 5G is expected to be 100 times faster than current speeds. But in order for the bands to travel, more transmitters are needed in closer proximity. The signal will be carried on new smaller towers that can fit on light poles like these. We are not against technology. But the Stop 5G group questions just how safe all these smaller towers will be for those who walk and live here. But before we become sort of the canary that is subjected to all of this, we want to actually have that data on safety be proven. Many of the towers are expected to be near schools. Bone marrow of a child absorbs 10 times the radiation of an adult. The company's pushing 5G, insisting what the towers will transmit is safe, but there's no concrete testing leaning for or against it. And until then, the Stop 5G group believes the project should halt. Flyers are popping up. These concerned moms expect hundreds to attend a town hall on Wednesday. And we want people to just be educated on what 5G is, what they can do about it. Now, besides the potential health hazard, people are also concerned about the fact that these towers will simply sit in their front yards and that potentially will bring down their property values. As I pointed out, there will be a town hall meeting on this Wednesday. A huge crowd is expected and we have all the information located at CBSChicago.com. For now, reporting live in Hinsdale, Jermont Terry, CBS 2 News. Erica. Thank you, Jermont.